Check it out! The doorknobs are missing here, too. Typical. <laughs> I assure you there'll be no shortage of doorknobs when George Avocados is mayor. Missing doorknobs mean angry voters. <laughs> <laughs> that Avocados guy gives me the creeps. Creeps? Creeps? Who has the creeps? <laughs> Calm down, Scooby-Doo. It's just like a figure of speech. I don't know. Maybe Scooby's onto something. After all, it's Avocados who benefits from the missing doorknobs. Good point. Maybe it's time we set a little trap for Crystal Cove's knob stealer. Too bad Daphne had to miss all the fun setting up these traps. Yeah, but I'll bet she's having a great time on her date. Hello? We got some news, baby. The tires that made the treads on the highway were only sold to two people in Crystal Cove. Gene Nerno Treadall and George Avocados. I knew it! Anyone with hair that perfect has to be guilty of something. So if George Avocados is the ghost trucker, that means the ghost trucker and the knob stealer are related. Like they're cousins? Like they're the same person. Whoa! Screaming pandas! What is the meaning of this? Dad, we think George Avocados is the ghost trucker, and he's trying to sabotage your re-election. That's completely absurd. Why would a ghost drive a truck when everyone knows they can fly? Especially an 18-wheeler. Those require a Class 6 license. But, Dad... I don't want to hear any more nonsense, Fred. Clearly, you and your friends have let your imaginations get the best of you. Snobby, snobby, snobby. Avocados now. Wait, what about me? When is Rung going to show up? I've already had twelve hands full of finger fries. Satellite trackers all set. There's avocados, straight ahead. Man, you'd think a villain would have a less embarrassing ride. I'm like, there's some heavy soup up ahead and we're all out of spoons. We're losing him on the radar. 